The Attorney General, Eric Holder, testified in March of 2013 to Congress that he was afraid to prosecute the too-big-to-fail banks because it would cause economic disruption. Now, I've been going after him in Newsweek for that, and he has backtracked. Uh, but for months, an Inspector General's report shows he claimed that they had gone after more than a billion dollars and over 500 people involved in mortgage fraud, which by itself would still be a drop in the bucket. But it turns out that, in fact, there were less than 100 cases involving $95 million, which really is a drop in a drop. <laughs> and he kept telling this lie. And so we, we also now have a government that does not go after people who are engaged in, in criminal frauds because they are considered so powerful that if they were prosecuted, it would damage the economy. My God.